symposium is to just shed some light on some boys that are going down a different path and we want to bring them back. We realize that many of the issues that we are facing in society is not necessarily starting from the high school, but it's basically starting here at the primary school level. And so what we want to do is to get these boys to see light, life in a different manner so that they can realize that they can be good. And if they are good, then they can actually become something positive in life. And so today we are hosting the Second Boys Symposium and we have many persons with us who are coming on board to help us to give the boys just a wonderful time. We start with breakfast, so for the day they get breakfast, then they get, you know, something to mentor in session, they get to interact with the different agencies that, you know, cater to children, and after that they get lunch, well, they get break, and then after break, they get a chance to, you know, have some hands-on activity, robotics, repairs from with JIS, and also, it's just, it's just a lot, it's a lot, it's just fun, so what I want to do, you have to just look, Mr. Marlon is going to take you around and show you the different things, as it's just a lot. After they are finished, they are going to be doing some hands-on activity, making chains, bracelets, uh, sip and paint, name it, and then after lunch, they are going to be doing massage, just a little, you know, little fun thing for them, relaxation. Then there is always, always the talent show, where we showcase the boys' talent, and after that, there is our um, a reward for them and everything. So it's just going to be an exciting, exciting day. It's too much right now to say all of it. <laughs> Hello everyone, people of St. Thomas. My name is Mario Sams, principal of Rural Hill Primary and Infant School. And so we are here at the Boys Symposium, the second edition of the Boys Symposium here in St. Thomas. You might be wondering how come I'm here as at a school in Portland, but we have ex the ex invitation was extended to us to schools in Portland, Seaside Primary, Rural Hill, and Windsor Forest Primary School, all three schools in Portland. And so we are happy to be here, right here, at the Boys Symposium, sharing in this exercise. And the reason why we're here, we take our boys to the symposium, is to empower our boys, our young men today, because statistics have shown that the boys are struggling academically, and so in particular, we want to empower them in such a way, in a meaningful way, so that they can become better future uh, leaders in tomorrow. And so this is one of the way, the methodology in which we are engaging our boys in a positive way to help them to boost their self-esteem, to build their confidence so that they can become better men for tomorrow. And so this is a very wonderful initiative by Mr. Jody Brown, who is a master teacher, Alaska teacher, and Alaska teacher of the year, and who has started this initiative. And I'm happy to say that I would have been a part of this inception. And so this is the second one, and so it has become better, better than last year. And I'm encouraging all the schools, particularly the parish of St. Thomas, to invite their boys right at the symposium to, so that they can become better men and so that they can contribute to society and they become well-rounded in their school and in their performance. And so we are happy to be here.